What is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King John 64, and today I'll be showing you guys some Overwatch gameplay. Hopefully, you guys enjoy it because, goddamn, this beta is a total beast. I love it. So, I'll probably be getting Overwatch once it releases, like in, uh, I believe, in May 23rd or something. I'm not sure what day it was, but, you know, it's gonna be released pretty soon. So, uh, a little bit of, uh, you know, what's going on in the gameplay right now. In the beginning of the match, you know, I was using this monkey and I wasn't doing shit. The weapon is weak as hell, but it's good for sneaking around sometimes. So, um, you can only kill a lot of people if you go one-on-one -on -one with that monkey. So, he didn't do a lot, of, a lot of things. So, later on in the match, I ended up switching out to a character named D.Va. And, god damn it, I caused so much havoc. I even clutched it on the second round. You guys are going to be able to see that. And it was a total freaking great move because if, if I wouldn't have done it... We would have lost in the second round. So, um, and by the way, what happened in the background, I just killed five people within a second. Kind of insane, man. I love her special self-destruct um, for the machine, which is kind of okay, I guess. You know, if we wouldn't have, um, you know, had that, it pretty sure would have been some missiles or something. But it's a, it's a great special for this character. And also, if you guys know how to use this character, you'll be able to dominate from close range with no problem. That machine, I mean, you gotta move around as fast as you can. Even though I know it's slow, um, you can kind of move around fast if you know how to fly from close range. And, you know, once you learn all those mechanics, you should be able to dominate with this machine. That's what I did this whole gameplay. And that's how I ended up getting 31 eliminations. 31 eliminations means 31 kills, which is, you know, a high number of freaking, for, for, for this freaking game since, you know, it doesn't last that long in every single match. So... Um, as you can see, I just took out two enemies back to back. As long as you keep kind of a sort of a distance, you would do good. And just watch this little part. As you can see, I flew towards this little pig right there. Because every time you see this guy, you better run away. Because he's just going to hook you up. He's going to throw you a hook. Uh, he's gonna, it's gonna cling on you, and he's gonna pull you in. It's kind of like a scorpion move, you know, like, get over here, fucking scorpion wannabe. But this one's fat, so, I don't know about scorpion, but it pretty much looks like he gained some weight, so... So yeah, that's why I hate about that pig, you know, he hooks you up, and once he does that, I call in the flying, you know, that flying special, and I fly towards him, and I'll push him back to save my ass, so that's one way to prevent yourself from getting hooked from that guy. And um, also, once your machine gets destroyed, you'll be able to get a, have a second life and run around with the with a woman inside the machine. It was She's a pretty much of a beast too, because that pistol is a rapid fire pistol, and also if you know how to move around, you should be able to take out enemies from close range too. It's a powerful pistol, by the way, so you should be able to do good. It kind of it kind of feels like Tracer's weapon. So um, instead of two, you only have one. So it's kind of similar to it. So if you guys saw this little part right now, the ninja he fucking got killed by me. I was jumping around, say, trying to save my ass. So uh, so yeah, total beast, man. I'm telling you. As you can see, look at that guy. Look at that guy trying to take me out. He can't. My character's a total beast from close range. It does have a lot of health, by the way. It has 500 HP. And by the way, yeah, I killed myself right there by accident. I thought I was going to fly all the way across, but I ended up falling in the ditch. Now watch this little part. Watch it, because I'm about to clutch the game. Watch. Look at the top. It's 90% to 99, I think. So they were super close to winning. 97%, 92%. Call in my special self-destruct mechanism. Bam! Five kills in a second. Oh, well, never mind. It was three. It was three kills, but hey, I clutched it up to, for my team to win the game, so... Pretty much can call me a hero in this game. Now round three, I pretty much didn't do a lot, but I ended up kind of defending the place pretty good. And uh, every time I saw an enemy flying around, I was like, "All right, let me follow, follow him with a flying mechanism," and pretty much caught up to him and took out the ninja yet again. And this icebreaker girl, you know, she's pretty much of a dope ass player too. So um, good thing she rose up that wall, defended the, the you know the point, the B flag, and this other John Marston wannabe, you know, he tried to sneak around, took him out. Total beast, and I got my special again. But this one I kind of messed up. I knew I should have put it on the goddamn stairs. I don't know why I called it in early. I think I panicked. To be honest, I think I panicked. It could have been another four kills or another three kills. It would have been insane. I would have been, you know, I probably would have gone like around 37 elimination towards the end of the match. So um, it was a missed opportunity. So there's this guy. That guy, that skater guy, doesn't really do a lot of damage. If you know how to use him, you really want to help out your teammates, and you gotta really learn how to use that guy. It's, kind of, it's quite difficult. I try to use him, and I just can't. I just can't really use his weapon. As you can see, I'm using the backup character. Took out one guy. Move around. Just keep moving around, because you don't have a lot of health either. You have 150 HP compared to your robot, which has 500, so you gotta really move around with that character. If not, it's a one-shot kill for everybody. Look at this guy. Trying to sneak around. Nope, you ain't going nowhere. You can't. I can't even shoot from long range because I know it won't do a lot of damage. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. Fly across the goddamn map. Push him back. 
Take him out from close range. Nice job by that icebreaker, girl. I don't even know why he called him an icebreaker, to be honest. And right here, there's another chance. I got my special. Call it in. Kamikaze. Murray. Try to cover yourself as, as fast as you can because also your explosion can take you out. So towards the end, I ended up winning the match. Victory, of course. Man, we ended up doing a comeback. Because in the first round, I thought it was like, it's a done deal. They dominated us freaking 99 to freaking 16. But towards the next two rounds, we ended up doing a comeback as I switched out to this character. So it was a total beast move by Meg, I guess. Five kills right there. So 31 elimination, guys. There you have it. If you guys enjoyed the gameplay, make sure to leave a like in the video. And also, when Overwatch comes out, I'll pick it up and show you guys more gameplay.